Good day, good day! How the honk are ya? This is your friend Dan O, and this is Roverland, the YouTube channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. Have I got a video for you today? All right, all right, all right, let's get into it! <laughs> Welcome to a one of Wednesday. Hey, uh, I gotta back up here a little bit. Uh, my friend Aaron, uh, in, uh, I don't, Statuas, I, you know, Aaron, I don't know how to pronounce your name. Statuies, Wicks, Statuits, Statuits. I'm going to go with that. Well, anyway, a couple of, um, uh, a unboxing video a while ago, um, uh, he sent me this and, uh, Aaron is an old time friend. Uh, back when uh, your friend Dano had a uh, Land Rover club in uh, in uh, Wisconsin called Badgerland Rovers, Badgerland Rovers, uh, Badgerland because Wisconsin is known as the Badger State. Uh, that's our uh, mascot and everything is the Badger. Well, anyway, so he sent me this, and I was told so tickled in pink. You know, he's just like. Hey Dan, uh, you know what's your you know what's your address? And I'm like, okay, uh, yeah, okay. So anyway, so he sent me this, and I, and I I didn't quite connect the dots till later because I it was an unboxing video, and I was just opening it up. And I thought for this one on Wednesday we could do this. This is from uh, Winter Spring, a 2003. And so I'm like, okay, why did Aaron send me this? Let me just. Uh, you know, check it out. Well, check it out. Ba bam! Here is an article from an old friend of mine, Tad Hilkema, uh, Broken Rules. And uh, this is a little story of a four wheeling expedition that uh, I uh, did with my uh, Land Rover group that I was with. And that that guy there, yeah, yeah, Christopher Zane Nestor in his uh, what what year is that? Oh one, oh two, uh, and I'm kind of going through here so you can kind of see, uh, read the article there a little bit. But anyway, um, here's my truck, yeah, and the windshield, and that's me, and uh, you can see here that uh, this strap went from this truck. And we obviously you see he's stuck big time, and we we strapped it in, and uh, and uh, I gave him a pull, and um, yeah, here's the picture we we giving him a pull, and uh, wouldn't you know it, that bugger came loose. It was a big chunk of the the. It's not that. That's a, just a bumperette, but a big chunk of uh, Nestor Christopher's uh, bumper. Um, broke loose and the, the strap came flying, flying through. The strap tapped me on the shoulder and the big chunk, and I still have the chunk of frame, went through the windshield. Yeah, just like that. And uh, so anyway, yeah, so if you want to, yeah, just kind of read that. I'm kind of going through there. But anyway, uh, thanks again, Aaron. I'm going to have to give you another shout out here. Uh, for that and uh, wow, thanks to Tad. I, I was kind of reunited with Tad He's still kind of in the area him and his wife, but anyway, so that is why um, <laughs> My friend Aaron sent me this Rovers North the news from Rovers North So anyway, pretty pretty cool. Anyway, if you ever find that uh, magazine or that uh, Hey, look me up. Hey, look at you kind of see me. I'm in my work shirt. All right. So, anyway, we are going to do a one-up Wednesday because we're already four minutes into the show. Um, the other day, and I had this cranked up here because uh, I wanted to show you my little glass case here, and we're going to talk about this later on. But um, we're going to talk about this. The other day, I got this bugger here in, uh, in my unboxing video, and so I had to pull out my um, inventory of my Tootsie Toys. So this is the bugger that I got. And you know, I buy stuff on eBay all the time, just anything and everything Land Rover. And then I get 
blessings, surprise blessings, and this happens to be one. Now, when I got this, uh, if you watch the video, go back and watch the video, uh, you'll notice that um, I was kind of perplexed about it because, you know, you know, I get hit on the head a lot, and I don't remember a lot, but something was different about this. Well, to tell you the truth, let's take, take a look at the differences. Right away, well, and I was kind of confused, that top is not yellow. It looks like it yellowed out, and it's not. It's red. So here's what it's supposed to look like. So this is a complete one. Um, you can see how the wheel's kind of yellow, but it's a white interior, black top, brown, with the sticker Tootsie Toy on it. And, you know, they don't have any dates or anything like that, just Tootsie Toy there and, um, you know, Land Rover. So, as you see, I've got quite a collection, so you can kind of tell, you know, so, you know, this is kind of the run of the mill. This is... This is what they're supposed to look like. This is this is the brown one that people, you know, that was very popular in the mid 70s. And uh, so let's kind of scoot these on. So now here are my, uh, the best of the best. This is, you know, these are the, in the case because they're like the best ones that I have of it. And look at the just pure white. Oh, I paid $5 for that one. And uh, just pure white, it's just, Pure white's got a tow hitch on the back, black with the brown. Okay, so that's fine. All right, so, but there are ones here, as you see, that have a brown interior. But it is the green one with the Tootsie, Tootsie Toy Land Rover on it. And you can see that there is a brown interior. Very, very um, uh, obvious, obvious. I mean, it, it, it's... It's two different types. Here's the brown one, which this is the first edition as far as I know. And then this is the second edition. So now, ba-boom, ba-bam, check it out. When we bring this guy back into the picture, you can tell that this one is definitely a different brown. It is just, it's different. It's a different brown. You can, you can tell, I don't know if you can really tell in the camera or not, but it, it is a different brown. I don't know some of it, if it's faded or whatnot. Now, you can, I'm, you know, you could say, oh, it's just faded. It's a, it's a white one, you know, that just got faded or something. No, the, the, the white, when it fades, it goes yellow. You know, it does, you know, it goes yellow. It doesn't go white, a brown. So anyway, so there is a distinct different interior on this one okay now i'm going to show you now this one's got chrome wheels to it and that's that was original that i got uh, and then there's this other style chrome wheel which is pretty cool uh but second generation and then there's this one here that had the brown wheels to it um really kind of cool and and the one that i i you know was my pride and joy and and uh you know just the 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 totally tickled me was this black one it's a black on black uh tootsie toy really kind of cool it's got the brown with the i don't know vent wheels on it but uh now <laughs> as you can see now i need a bigger case because this one is now pretty snazzy man yeah check it out it definitely is and and so it's not faded it's not you know ozone you know uh the plastic is not because it would be different color than on top you know and and it's and it's permanent i mean there's the rivets in there so i guess what all i can assume is is you know like most um companies that just like Land Rover, you just keep making the part till the part is gone and then you upgrade it when you come to the next series, you know, series one. There's a lot of series twos that got some series one parts on it. You know what I'm saying? And Tootsie Toy, I think was the same thing is, you know, they, uh, you know, were pushing out these toys. Um, they had the brown bodies, but then they ran out of the white interior. 
So then they just slapped on, you know, the brown interior. But it it just it it just looks to me like it's different colors. I I mean it's a different shade, but it probably isn't. It probably is this color and just maybe a little tinted. Uh, I know it's kind of hard to pick up. Uh, you know what? Comment down below. Do you think this is a totally different interior? Or is it just the second generation stuck on a first generation body? Regardless, it's awesome. I love it. This is cool. This is grand. This is uh, just another thing to put in my case. Another toy that I bought for, you know, seven bucks or whatever, but it's a variation that I didn't have. And variations and these kind of things are hard to come by because they pumped out so many, you know, just the regular... The regular stuff so you know it's so there you go really kind of cool <laughs> all right that's it for a one up wednesday for me thank you for joining me today uh this is your friend dano make sure you give me a big thumbs up come over to roverland on the facebook page that's it i'm out of here remember slow traffic keep right and have a great rover day